problem asks us to compare the volumes of these two rectangular pyramids, labeled A and B, let A be the volume of A, and B be the volume of B, how are A and B related? First, what is volume? Think of it as the amount of space a 3D object takes up, like how much water you could pour inside. For any pyramid, the volume has a specific formula. Volume equals one-third times the area of the base times the height. Why one-third? It's a cool geometric fact. A pyramid's volume is exactly one-third of the prism with the same base and height. Think of it like fitting three pyramids perfectly into one box of the same base and height. Now, our pyramids have rectangular bases. The area of a rectangle is just length times width. So the formula becomes volume equals one-third times length times width times height. Trick spotlight. We'll use this volume formula volume equals one-third length width height to find the volumes A and B separately. Remember this formula. Let's calculate A, the volume of pyramid. A from the image, the base dimensions are 12 over X and X. The height is 12. Plugging into our formula, A equals one-third times 12 over X times X times 12. Look closely at the base part. 12 over X times X, the X's cancel out, leaving just 12. So uh, simplifies to uh, one-third times 12 times 12. 12 times 12 is 144. And one-third of 144 is 48. So volume A is 48. Now for B, the volume of pyramid bits base dimensions are 12 and X, and the height is 12 over X. Using the same formula, B equals one-third times 12 times X times 12 over X. Again, look at the terms being multiplied. 12 times is 6 times 12 over X. The X's cancel out here too. We are left with B equals one-third times 12 times 12. Hey, that looks familiar. Just like before, this is one-third times 144, which is also 48. So B is 48. We found that A equals 48 and B equals 48, therefore A equals B. Looking at the options, option H matches our result. Follow for more thorough breakdowns Yay. for ACT math.